A local program provides free treatment for those struggling to overcome substance abuse of any kind. Yeah, and tonight in our special series of reports, Project Addicted, Local 12's Liz Bonus introduces us to a team which says it is all about filling the hunger within. This team fighting addiction really says it's about inspiring hope. They shared with us as we were preparing for our What's Happening in Health show, airing Saturday at noon. But here's more about free care for those addicted at Heritage House. Well, Heritage House, we have 70 men that are housed in Heritage House and then people on a list waiting to get in because it's not funded by the government, it's funded by faith. It's a faith-based ministry. There is no charge for any part of the residential addiction treatment program at Heritage House. It saved the life of Kenneth Grimmett after years of what started, he says, with cocaine. Then it got to pain pills from about a couple years after that till 18 and then finally 18 years old, um, I started doing pain pills with my father. Um, you know, and I was buying them, he was buying them. It got to the point where I was so addicted that if we both had a bottle of pills, I would take out of his bottle and try to hide it. Eventually, Kenneth says meth and heroin took everything away. His wife, he says, stayed as long as she could. Finally, she looked at me in my eyes and she told me, you know, it's time to choose either you got to get help or I can't be a part of it. So you, you got know, help and you got help with Heritage House. Yes. So how long have you been clean? I've been clean a year and a half. Praise God. You know, it all started when I did go into the Heritage House. A guy by the name of Cody Jones, the house leader, um, I was meeting with him and he looked my mom in the eyes that day and he said, you know, you'll never have to see your son like this again. Now, to continue programs to help fight addiction, Heritage inviting you to the Hope is Here Gala next week. So the Hope Gala is about what? It's about raising finance, introducing the community to what we're doing in the west side of Cincinnati, which has been a very difficult place lately with all the shootings and things that are happening. Heritage House also focuses on community outreach for those struggling with addiction, and when they do. It's so exciting to see these guys' lives changed and then their families enriched and, and the transformation is because they have hope. It is another chance. You do deserve another chance in life. Both Cletty Keith, a pastor at Heritage Fellowship, and Kenneth, who you just met, a graduate of Heritage House, want to invite you to that Hope is Here Gala. It's coming up on August the 10th, and it is at the Newport Syndicate. We have all the details you need to know at local12.com. Guys. And in addition to the ticket information, you can also have your name added to a waiting list at Heritage House if needed. You can go to our website at local12.com.